What's up guys, welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Today we're going to go over some news that just hit us. Uh, Mona's story is coming out. It's going to be costing keys to do. Uh, Adventure 20, rank 26 is some form of requirement, but actually you need to be Adventure rank 38 to actually access it. It's kind of weird, we're going to go over it, so on and so forth. And we're just going to list things down and whatnot. Um, as for the beginner's guide is coming out soon. I just need time to edit it out um, Building a guide takes time instead of just sitting here Showing you guys exactly what what you could do to start and, and things like that uh, I want it to look a little pretty on uh, and, and things like that um, Don't forget to subscribe and Hit that like button if you guys want to see other content on Genshin uh, if you want me to go back to Dokkan content, also comment down below if you guys would like to see some Dokkan stuff as well. Uh, thinking about getting in, back into the game, by the time this video comes up, I will be doing a Dokkan stream at nighttime on Saturday. Um, that will be my Dokkan day from now on. Uh, I hope to see a lot of you there, and uh, let's get ready. Misuts. All right, we're here. We're on the Japanese uh, Genshin stuff because there are some things that aren't on the global side and uh, The Chinese side we also have Zenith up Zenith is the man. He's literally the homie Goresh Version for Genshin pretty much. He's he's the boy. He's the single best Twitter Genshin account you guys should follow him if you want information and so on and so forth I'll leave a link to his Twitter down below and um yeah, we're gonna we're gonna run through some of the news that we've been getting. The department store rare item uh, event introduction. I don't know if the global version has any anything on this, but uh, to the travelers with the start of the new event department store rare or rare department store, a uh, new event will be added to the travelers missions. You can earn travel experience points by completing event missions. So um, it says travel experience points, so ADR. I assume it's gonna cost resin to do. And you travel mission, season mission, and then do the detailed achievement conditions. And during the event period, you can open a rare box by completing the mission of the merchant Tate Moto. And um, yeah, you, you'll look for him using the compass or open a short roulette and open a uh, compass mark. And uh, you go find him, and you trade it in. And then during the event, Tidemoto will appear in various um, places, various various places in te uh, Tivat, and you can receive seven different types of rare boxes. So for the rare boxes, we don't know exactly what we're going to be getting, and you only get rewards once for each rare box. So you have seven different boxes you can collect, and. Uh, we uh, the event is about a week starts on the 26th and it'll be held until the end of, um if you do do not open one of your boxes it'll be held to the end of the event so um so if you don't open the box and you let it ride it'll you'll only be able to get one so you need to open these up every day uh you lose all your chances because the boxes end up going away uh at the end of it uh so I'm gonna wait for more information. I will make another video uh, covering it once we get even more information. But another thing that we're getting is the Mona mission. Uh, the Mona storyline is coming out. This legendary mission function opening conditions you re you need 26, but to participate in it, you actually need uh, 38 to be able to uh, to do it. Uh, Chapter of the Night Owl and Act One Alibi of the Hero of the Dark Knight. So, I don't know, so so we're getting Alibi, Hero of the Dark Knight, because we've cleared Chapter of the Night Owl, I assume, that's that's what's going on, but Adventure Rank 38 is going to give us access to a new quest, more Adventure Rank experience, uh, between, who knows, up to 500, maybe 1000, we're not sure, sometimes it can be generous, sometimes these stories can't be, for what I know, Gene had more than Cleese, but Venti had more overall. I, I'm not exactly 100%. I can't 100% remember, but I'm pretty sure it went somewhere around there. And um, let me take a 
I just noticed this was going on in my uh, in my thing, the merch rotator. Uh, let's get that out of there. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, the Aiden chapter. That's why it's called. Uh, if we go to Zenus over on Twitter, uh, let me go ahead and make sure I drop this man a follow because he is amazing. He is good on point. He has really good leaks. Um, and I didn't get a chance to talk about this on my resin video, but uh, here we go. Astro Labs chapter is about to unfold. Available uh, 2020, 10, 26, permanent. Doesn't go away. Use a story uh, key to unlock Mona's story quest. Travelers obtain keys by completing daily uh, commissions. Mona's uh, chapter unlocks at AR38 and the completion of Dark Knight's uh, Heroes Alibi quest. Uh, so you have to finish the Deluxe quest, uh, quest line, I believe, uh, which is good. And um, this is actually pretty cool. Uh, this means we're probably going to get a character trial, so we're probably going to be able to use Mona in her chapter, like we were able to do with Klee, so on and so forth. Um, this is actually really dope. So if you don't have Mona, this is a good chance to see if you would ever roll for her if she's ever on a rate up banner, which is cool, which is very cool to me personally. And um, yeah, the treasure event starts around the same time, so we're getting content in two days. Pretty nice. Pro probably not this expansive content that we all want, but it's content nonetheless. Something nice to take our minds off of the terribleness that is. <coughs> <coughs> resin um but yeah um we're gonna have some cool things to do um these are the treasure boxes for the treasure box event uh as you notice like there's one of each slime anemo water uh cryo fire dendro uh geo and electro which is a uh, pretty cool pretty pretty cool and uh if you guys haven't noticed we got a clee letter there's four more uh, the first one gave us 200 prim prim uh, Primo Gems. Blah, can't speak. One Fragile Resin. I'll take it. It's precious. My precious. And uh, we got some experience for our characters. Uh, five epic cheats, I think. Five. I, I, I don't know what it's called. I just call it epic because it's purple. And uh, for the MiHoYo uh, feedback summarized, uh, decreased resin requirement in BP to 1600 from 1600 to 1200. Max resin increased to 160. Key, key bind and controller release, thank goodness. Artifact filter, really nice. Waypoint teleport item, very very good. Small character icon on equipped gear. That's a nice little quality of life. This is what needed to be improved, and I did make a video on it. Uh, link will be in the description down below, along with all these other things. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys give this information a look. I would say definitely, definitely give it a look. Up, uh, upvote this stuff. Um, retweet, you know, give your opinions. You know, Zenith is doing an amazing job. Amazing job. Number one Genshin Impact Tweeter. That's not even a joke. That's real. He's like the god of information you know this is amazing amazing you, you give the homie a thumbs up he literally allows us to make videos like this so that it's super digestible on youtube and and, and things like that but yeah mona coming out rundown new element new little uh, rare box event clee has letters that she's sending us 200 prima gems each hopefully um gives a total of uh i think a thousand yeah a thousand prima gems if that's the case which is good really good for free play really good for those refreshes if you really do refresh and these 1.1 uh quality of lives pretty good except resin needs to be changed once again i made some changes you guys should thumbs up that video so that you know or or share it so people kind of like you know they kind of get that oh yeah you can you can really use this to slowly, you know, betterment the quality of life when it comes to resin, because we definitely will do need it. Because if we get multiple bosses of different element, we're gonna need a ton of resin to be able to clear all the bosses every week, so that we can get good gear, so on and so forth. Um, but yeah, I well, thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much. There's a little news update. Um, sticking around, listening to all the news, all this crazy stuff. You know, follow Zenith on Twitter. Uh, make sure you hit the like button, 
subscribe button, that red button there. If you guys haven't uh, hit it yet, I don't know where I point you to, to be honest. And make sure you hit the bell notifications so that you know when my videos come out. Well, thank you guys for watching. And as always, happy adventuring.